Some people gonna be. Some people gonna get. Um, their chaps will be bunt. Their chaps will be bunt. Some people's chaps buns will be chapped. Yeah. Some people's buns will get chapped. Yo, what is up, all you Stone Cold Superfly, Illmatic, Fish, Keeping, Funkadelics? You watch Aqua Funk Aquatics with me, Aqua Funk. Today we're gonna be talking about the Electric Blue Jack Dempsey. It's a mouthful. I'm winded. Um, just <laughs> a lot of people just call it the EBJD, which is, to me is just as a mouthful as Electric Blue Jack Dempsey. So, <clears throat> listen. I uh, I like to give credit where credit is due. So let me start out this video um, automatic by giving some shout out to a young channel out there called Aqua Papa. Now, <clears throat> Aqua Papa, man, there's something in my throat. Aqua Papa is a young channel that uh, I came across when I was checking out um, stuff on this electric blue Jack Dempsey. And uh, he actually is, is, is pretty cool. He, he uh, he's, he's, he's no editing. You know, like like talking about nothing like I do. What I do is just stupid. I, I don't even know. <laughs> it's ridiculous, <clears throat> but it's real. And he's not afraid to tell you the raw truth um, as far as his fish room goes, good, bad, or indifferent. So head on over to Aqua Papa. I'm gonna leave a link in the comments and the description section below um, and show him some sub love. Tell him Aqua Punk sent you. All right. So um, Aqua Papa. <laughs> go back to Aqua Papa. Um, <clears throat> he. Uh, he kind of started it off with, with a very intriguing video, um, which kind of got me going wanting to do this. So, um, but but one of the reasons why I was interested in what he had to say is because I had, a, you know what? I'm gonna do I'm gonna do I'm gonna do another video. Did I already say that? I'm so unprofessional. So I'm gonna do another video, and that other video is gonna be a little bit more risque probably gonna be a lot more risque and I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate on my um my uh my comment section but I, I feel it's necessary to, to be real and honest with you guys so <clears throat> but in order to see that video you're gonna have to subscribe hit the notification bell and please leave a thumbs up um the only way my channel can grow is if uh you know you guys show some love by hitting that thumbs up so that Aquafunk Aquatus can grow maybe I can help somebody out who my particular cadence, flavor, style, whatever you want to call it, resonates with somebody. So please, cost you nothing, but it's priceless to my channel. Hit that thumbs up, leave a comment. Let me let, let me know what you think about um, the Electric Blue Jack Dempsey, if you've had it in the past. Um, so into the video, I don't normally like to talk about things that I don't know about. I don't like to read um, other people's uh, experiences and pretend they're my own. So. Um, I, I, I held off from doing a video on this electric blue jack Dempsey and the reason why I felt it necessary now is because I noticed something about this electric blue jack Dempsey um, it was kind of rowdy now you guys are probably thinking well it's a Jack Dempsey yeah but you know what 20 years ago 21 years ago um, I had three electric blue jack Dempseys in fact I was working at the pet store and when they came when they came out I was like oh my god they're gorgeous I mean you know that you know they're gorgeous fish. So they were expensive too. They're like twenty-five, thirty dollars back then. Um, anyway, I, I got some money together and I went down with the intent on buying as many as I could. I didn't have much money, but I was able to pick up three. And back then, you get them, they, they were like this little. They were like one inch long. Um, and uh, I got three of them, and I only had enough money for a uh, regular Jack Dempsey, which, which really irritated me because. That regular Jack Dempsey killed those other those other three electric blue. That five dollar fish killed the twenty five dollar fish. So I was I was irritated about that. And as I was working at the pet store, other people came in saying that their Jack Dempsey, the electric blue Jack Dempsey, were dying on them. And uh, that's how come I stood away from them for so long. But I know other fish tubers and friends that have kept them for successfully for quite some time without having to do any crazy stuff. So um, I jumped back in and got me an electric blue Jack Dempsey. On the Electric Blue Jack Dempsey, it gets its name from the boxer in the 20s, oh, Jack Dempsey. Um, they, they say it's because of the likeness in the face. I, I, don't, I don't know how the real Jack Dempsey would have felt about that. Like, <laughs> I, I, I would consider it an honor if somebody named the fish after me, but not if it was because I looked like that fish. But uh, it, it's a, it's not a hybrid. It's not mixed with a electric blue, a car, or nothing like that. It's actually a recessive gene that pops up. Now, for those of you who don't know what a recessive gene is, just a gene that just pops up. Um, it's a little different than what's normal. Like you know, like two different color eyes, or recessive genes, or 
a blonde streak or the, the thing where uh, you have um, pigment loss and patches of your skin. It just happens, you know? And what they did was they found fish with this recessive gene and just kept breeding them together until their babies came out like that. So that's how the recessive, that's how the electric blue jack, it's called selectively breeding. Now the problem with selectively breeding is that um, not only do you breed the good stuff, but you also breed the bad stuff. So um, I, was, I, was, I was skittish for these guys for a long time. And uh, let me tell you a little bit about them because it's important because electric blue jack Dempsey's are not quite the same as regular Jack Dempsey's. There are differences. So you can't really go by, oh, they're all, you know, Jack Dempsey blue, Black Jack Dempsey regular. It is what it is. It's regular. It's the same. It's not really the same. There they are differences um, because of the selective breeding. For instance, um, they both do come from, well, the regular Jack Dempsey comes from Central America, Mexico, you know, area. Um, whereas the electric blue Jack Dempsey, while may happen in the wild, um, it's quickly picked off because of the coloration. It can't hide. It's it's just like a sore thumb for any predator fish. So the electric blue jack Dempsey is bred in captivity. You're not gonna find them in a while. Uh, they get to about seven, give or take an inch or two. I've seen I've seen a good seven eight inch um, jack Dempsey. I read somewhere that they can get twelve inches. <sighs> hey hey. Hey, if you if you seen a 12 inch Jack Dempsey, please put it in the comments and tell me where I can see this picture of this 12 inch Jack Dempsey because they do not get that big. I'm sorry. Um, I don't, that's why I don't like reading com reading some of this stuff. Look at that. Look at that apple snow. Just... That's why I don't like reading some of this stuff because anybody can put anything on there. So I like to come at my videos from a place of experience. So that's what come. I did a video until I had something to say. Um, so anyway, they get about seven, give or take. They're slow growers. Um, they, the, the the regular Jack Dempsey's grow faster than the electric blues. The electric blues will probably get man, two inches a year, you know, give or take. Um, they're omnivorous. They they both are omnivorous, so they'll eat pretty much anything you feed them. But they want to they, they want that meaty stuff. Um, so frozen is preferred. Uh, they're perfect fish for a 55, growing eight inches. You know, a male and a female and a 55. Tank mates, tank mates. At one point, I would have said. Tank mates should be non-aggressive fish, cichlids, uh, but something in my eye. But this fish is obviously um, more aggressive than I remember these things to be. And um, I would give this guy um, semi-aggressive to aggressive fish. I don't think they're like I don't. I don't they're not as aggressive as um, regular Jack Dempsey's. But like I said, this guy um, I've had him for a little while now, and he's. He, like right now, he's he, he's claiming the the tank. Um, he gets in it with this Robert Sonine, and, and they're not going to be in this tank for long. This is just temporary, and um, he's not very skittish. I remember them being very skittish, and he's not. So I assume, I assume that over the years the line has gotten better. Um, now there's no such well, there is a such thing as a 100% electric blue jack Dempsey, but it's very very rare that you see them. They actually are so blue that they look like a uh, like a blue Akara. This Jack Dempsey, the ones you see now, will, you'll see black speckling through them, and that's because in order to strengthen a bloodline to get rid of any hereditary issues that you come up with with um with a uh, um, selectively breeding fish, uh, you have to breed them back into the original, which would be a regular Jack Dempsey. So you'll see um, a lot of blue with black speckling. Like I said, uh. uh a full, full electric blue is, is, is really, really blue with almost no black, but uh, the pH, pH, you know, 7.5, give or take, you go up to 8, you go down to 7. Temperature, high 70s, low 80s. Uh, males and females, are hard to tell apart. Um, the males will get long streamers. I, I believe this is a female, actually, because I would probably see a little bit more streamers on the dorsal and anal fin at, at this age, but um, I'm not seeing that. So I'm thinking this is a female. I, you know what? I, I don't know what it is. I, I have a knack for picking out female fish. I don't know what it is. So can y'all tell me why? 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 I mean, look, I don't have a problem with, you know, you know, I don't want it as a female, but the males do get a little bit more spectacular, you know, as far as finish goes, but I seem to always pick out female fish. Maybe I should pick out, maybe I should get like 10, of, but that's expensive. You know, getting 10 and then waiting for them to grow up so I can pick out the males. Anyway, 
At one point, I would have said don't. At one point, I would say don't get an electric blue jack Dempsey. And if you did, keep them in their own tank with no other fish around. But I, this 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 guy has changed my opinion on the electric blue jack Dempsey. I do believe he can hang with the best of them. And if you heard what I heard about them being fragile um, back in the day, um, not so much no more. Not so much no more. I have been seeing a lot more of them being sold at the pet store, bigger sizes than just one inch. Um, so they, they are they are living and they're they're thriving. Um, so and I, and and that's what I'm going to I'm going to talk about. I'm going to talk about my opinion on I, look. I did not know there was a big hoopla over the electric blue jack Dempsey, where some people are pro and some people are against. And I have theories on that, and that's what I'm going to talk about in my next video. So, so like I said, you got to hit that notification bell, thumbs up, and subscribe, and all that good stuff, so you can you can hear what I have to say. Some people gonna be, some people are gonna get, um, their chaps will be bun. Their chaps will be bun. Some people's chaps, buns will be chapped. Yeah, some people's buns will get chapped. Um, but this is my opinion. Um, and uh, that's just it, you know. Electric Blue Jack Dempsey. I, 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 I think I want to do a tank of them. I think I do, and I know where I can get them. Um, hey, look, check it out. Uh, you guys, um, you really should subscribe. I got some huge things coming that will benefit you as a viewer, not only uh, entertainment-wise, education-wise, but uh, um, financially. So. Hit that subscribe button, notification bell, and leave a thumbs up. I appreciate you. And don't forget to go check out my man, um, Fish Papa. Sorry, Aqua Papa. Uh, and let him know Aqua Funk said you. will not be able to stay home, brother. You will not be able to plug in, turn on, and cop out. The first revolution is when you change your mind about how you look at things. And see that there might be another way to look at it that you have not been shown. Will put you in the driver's seat. Revolution will not be televised, not be televised. There'll be no rerun, brothers and sisters. The revolution will be live.